fucking gay. I'll go. Ass and fucking sluts. Something, something, something. There's a word, guys. There's a word that starts with an N. That word is... Nutella. Nighttime. I thought you were going to say Nigeria. Nigeria is cool. I, I like Nigeria. Nickelback! No, no. Get the fuck off. <laughs> Go in there. <laughs> Take a shot of the shave with No! No, pull me down! Ah! <laughs> You must consume the shame whiskey. <coughs> that actually leads to a really good question. Where did the hate for Nickelback come from? Your mom. What, what's it all about? You know, Nickelback, they're a good pop rock band, right? Yes. They're the best! You take that back, you filthy whore! They're the best. Not the. Can she call me a whore on, on air? I, I didn't I say. I said house. But oh, she said I said it wrong. Yeah, yeah. I said it wrong. I, 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 I misheard you. I have a hat! He wants my hat. Give him the hat. Does! Hey, you almost got any of the balls. With my hat. For everyone listening, I doubt there's anyone at all, but for everyone listening, my wife almost hit me in the balls with the cap off a booze bottle. A bottle of booze. One of us may or may not be drunk. We'll never tell you which one's drunk. Yeah, babe. But you can guess in the comments, if you exist. Shut the fuck up, babe! Don't be mean to the baby girl. Why do people yell at their dogs? You know the dog just thinks you're barking with them. Okay. The dog's I've... throwing. The dog's throwing the shit. Throwing throwing the fucking fit at the mailman. Bark 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 bark. You're like shut the fuck up. The, the dog thinks you, just hears you going. Bark, 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 bark. They're like fuck yeah man. Fuck yeah we'll get him. We'll get him. <laughs> Motherfuckers think you're hyping them up. That right, babe? Yeah. Kill that someone. Happened? Like you got their fucking back, man. You're their man. Babe, babe, You're going to go fuck the whip mailman up. <laughs> babe, Have you ever met some of, of the mailmen? They can be cunts. I banged one of the mailman's wife one, wives one time. I banged a mailman. I, I just go get my mail. I, I just... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! You, you, do you see what happened? She put her nose under my... See, now, now our listeners down. may have sorry, determined baby. who is drunk off of that statement alone. <laughs> babe? Probably babe. Yeah. She just ran into my hand a second ago. Like, I don't know what the fuck happened, man. Man, I mean, think she's not as bad as Batty. I automatically assume Batty's been drinking all day. If water was meth... <laughs> Yeah, that, that's more Kyla than Batty. <laughs> that's what's wrong with Batty. He, she, you know, Can we say Kyla's guess. name on the air? No, fuck This you. goes on YouTube. I'm going to edit this shit out. She's going to hear it. No. I'm going to get the like angry gingers of the like the Pisces or something. They're gonna just we got the angry Pisces hey. right here. Hey, I don't mean it that way. I don't hey. mean it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The rest of the Pisces do not claim her. I know, no, I know. <coughs> no, she's not even a Pisces. She's a Capricorn. I was just using words. <laughs> But her star sign is Pisces. Her side is Capricorn. Her sun sign is. Hmm. She's a she's a she's a Capricorn, and her thing is. She she was a she was a Capricorn in Aries, because that's why she's so obsessed with justice. Because justice is the Aries and Capricorn, and so she's like. Everything that's inside me is on the outside of you, and everything on the outside of you is on the inside of me, Baby. and it makes no fucking sense, but... <laughs> she kidnaps me because she finds us on YouTube. You have to consider me. I mean, you either die a hero or live long enough to become a, the, the villain, right? Yeah. That's, that's Kyla. I mean, right. Dustin's gone. Now she's got to be Dustin. <laughs> oh, no. Dustin's not gone. He's in prison. <laughs> no, he's already out. His mom calls and calls checks on him every week. Or her, her mom calls and checks, <laughs> checks in with the jail every week. I know where the bitch is living at. <coughs> She's living at those apartments <coughs> over by the cowboy church. Which one is the... 
you have to know more specific. We are in a small town in Remember Texas. Remember Buttons? Buttons, if, if you didn't tell Tannen about Buttons, you have the Cowboy Church. You have to tell us which church you're talking about. You haven't told Tannen about Buttons. Tannen was still hanging out with us when the Buttons happened. He knows yeah, why. He, I remember the buttons. He knows why you don't mention buttons to me. She wants her goddamn buttons. <laughs> it's kind of like the, the lady that came to pizza. So for our listening audience who doesn't exist, um, we recently encountered a situation very much like this up at Pizza Hut. We had a Karen come in. Was it similar to the... Hold no on. thought! Situation. No, no, no. This, this was scarier. This was not the no fat guy. This was the Cine Beast. Dear God. The Cine Beast. Did he have long nails? So, we had a. a Scratching on the wall as she walked in? She did. She. Yeah, it was horrible. There were sparks flew off the door. It was fucking terrifying. Dear God. But so. Did she say, "I'm your worst nightmare, bitch"? <laughs> I mean, she might have. It was. It was kind of hard to tell over all the incoherent screeching she was doing. Dear God. <laughs> but, no! this bitch. So, apparently earlier in the day, she had ordered Cinnabons. Some people, you do not deny their sweets, okay? You do not deny their sweets. But earlier in the day, she, she ordered Cinnabons. Mm -hmm. On that day, we had run out of the breadstick boxes. We were using the, the, the dessert boxes for our breadsticks as well. Her, her original order of, of Cinnabons got mixed up with their breadsticks. So she got an order of breadsticks instead of Cinnabons. So she called back up to the morning manager, because this happened around noon. I didn't come in until 6 o'clock this night. This happened around noon. So she calls back up there, and apparently when they did, did the remake, it got mixed up with cheese sticks again. So she got two free orders of cheese sticks. God damn it! Three. Wow, babe. Hey, she, she, she's fast. You gotta watch her. Babe just pants our co-host. Uh, the idiot who may or may not be drunk. Hey, David, can I have so, some of that? Hold, um, on, hold on, guys. I gotta finish the story. So the, the Cinebeast. Yeah. Babe, in? At this point in the story, she's already got... It's charging. At this point in the story, she's already got two free breadsticks, right? Two free cheesesteaks, I think. But breadsticks, cheesesteaks. What the fuck ever? It's bread with cheese on it. But... How do you know it's not cheese with so bread So she calls it? she calls back up here right after I get there that day. And she talks to one of the CSRs, the 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 young man named Percy. Jackson. We can discuss that one in a minute if you want to. But she she talks to Percy and she she all she tells Percy is she gives her she Percy get, gets her number off the caller ID. No, didn't even get me a number. Percy didn't even, didn't even get a number for me. That's what it was. Because this lady called up there. Yeah, we had a screwed up order. I need my Cinnabons, blah, 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 blah. Gave her an address and, and, and basically told us to have, have it to her. Well, you bring this to me. I, I just came on shift. I'm the manager. You know what I can't do at Pizza Hut? You know what I cannot do? What? I cannot just send people fucking free food. <laughs> That's not how it works. You give me money, I give you food. <laughs> this lady calls up there and gives me an address. Well, what the fuck do I do with this? All right. I'll send you a Christmas card. I don't know. <laughs> Go back to the fucking house. Yeah. Toilet paper. Shit. I don't know. <clears throat> so. Shit. You wouldn't be saying that if it was 2020. <laughs> but, you know. All we got was an address, but I'm being cool about it. I'm not being hurt on Percy for not, not getting me all the information I needed. I'm not I'm not even throwing a fit about, fit about the, this person on the phone. I'm just like, okay, well, I have to wait for her to contact me. I, I have to actually talk to this person because I have to find out their phone number. I have to be able to see the ticket. I have to I have to be able to justify any, any whatever food I send her, right? Mm -hmm. Otherwise, my boss is going to yell at me about it on Tuesday at the manager meeting. <clears throat> so I wait. This lady finally calls back about an hour and a half later. And I first become aware of this situation because Percy comes walking up to me with the most traumatized look on her face. She's like, the person with the Cinnabon called back, they're, they're on that phone right there. <laughs> I'm just looking at Percy's face and I'm like, oh. I pick up that phone. Hello, my name's David. I'm the manager. Listen, you fucking son of a bitch. 
<laughs> Holy shit. And she just starts laying into me, and I'm just like, you know, three times I ask her. And, you know, it, it's it's like fucking dealing with a demon, right? Three times you ask, finally they have to answer. Right. <laughs> right. It's like, is this the number you, you originally ordered from? Yeah. Is this the number you were, is this the number Fucking that you that ordered number. from? <laughs> yes, it is. Okay, okay. Oh, shit. So I punched that number in and I fucking get that ticket up and I fucking find, at least now I have a ticket, right? At least now I can see that there was actually an, actually an order. Okay, ma'am. I'm sorry for, for whatever happened. I just came on shift. This obviously happened earlier in, earlier in the day. I have your ticket. I, based on your phone number, I'm able to, I'm able to see the ticket now. <laughs> and I'm about to tell her I'm gonna get your empty cinnamon right in the oven. And she goes, I'm in the parking lot. <laughs> I'll be inside in a minute, you. Ma'am, you can't act like this in here. Click. <laughs> <laughs> so she comes slinking into the. In, in, you, know, <laughs> you ever seen those horror movies where like the fucking pumpkin head is coming through the doorway and he's like. <laughs> God. This was the Cine Beast. All right. And she gets up there and she comes right up to the counter and she she grabs her ticket out of her pocket and sticks her right across the face up right across the fucking uh, counter up against my nose. This is my goddamn ticket. You need to calm down. You need to calm down, ma'am. We got we we got have guests in here. Uh -uh. You know, this is a public setting, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> you can't fucking talk to me fucking like that. Ma'am! <laughs> Finally, I literally have to turn away from her. I'm getting you your Cinnabons. I'm gonna go get your Cinnabons. You're just gonna have to wait for them. It's gonna take about eight minutes. So I walk away from her. And I got the Cinnabons and I put them in the oven. They, they were prepared very perfectly, very nicely. But every minute she waited, she hit Micah up. Are my Cinnabons ready? I'm surprised Micah didn't take her bitch ass to the floor. I think Micah was having too much fun watching me stress about this. <laughs> yeah, every time that he sounds like me, Micah. Every time he looks at me, he just got this smile on his face. He's like, yeah. Yeah, you like that? Ew. That's gross. <laughs> I guess what? It's the same people that used to call it Dickies. Somehow, or at least people, there's more people like them apparently. Because, you know, I get lots of phone calls every month. So I just like, hi. How are you? I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, is it your middle delivery carryout, ma'am? You okay? Uh, oh, I'm just fine. I, <coughs> I want to know what's. Hey, don't be making fun of me. It ain't my fault I got a fucking smoker's coat. <laughs> no, man, this is like the... You don't sound like... You, you at no point on the phone have I ever felt like you sounded like you were actively playing with your titties. <laughs> That's what it sounded like. That's what it sounded I'm not joking. This kid, I, don't, I can't even remember what happened, but this lady would, would reach you over the phone with her words. You had to pull it away and be like, Yeah, yeah, you, oh, yeah you Truman, you man, you fine. Oh, yeah, I don't know this. Yeah, whatever, man. I'll get it for you, man. She's not yelling. She's, she's just like, Oh, and... After you get on the phone, oh, you want to shower. Yeah. You feel like you just got molested, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm like, Oh, I hang up the phone. I'm looking at Miranda's face. Oh, oh, oh. For those of y'all that don't know and ain't listening, Miranda's a bitch we used to work with. Yeah. Dude. She's got a thicker beard than any man I've ever seen. I've got a pretty thick beard, motherfucker. Hers is thicker. She let me braid it like that. <laughs> yeah, it was like a scene in Vikings. Yeah. She was being she was playing Ragnar. Tandon here was playing Magrita. What? There was one time when we were still at Dickie's, I was closing with her, and this guy came in, he was a douchebag trucker, and he kept calling Miranda. I just farted sir. for those who keep and score at home. <laughs> what the fuck, David? So that's why it smells like dirty dishwater. Ew. You got sidetracked. That's fucking You're gross. drunk. 
How do you know you're not the one who's drunk? Yeah, I'm baby. sure that every person who listens to this listens, 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 listens to this can tell that I am a paragon of virtue and that I would never get too drunk. Ha! Lie again, Nigerian. If you agree, if you agree, thumbs up. If you agree, thumbs up. <laughs> or else. If you disagree, leave a comment saying David is bold as fuck. David. We had to feed you burritos the other day. <laughs> <laughs> you had to feed me burritos? Yeah, you were in the bed, you know, all day, but you were drunk, and you didn't feel good, you looked a little sick. So we fucking got you burritos, and then you're like, oh, yeah, I want it, and you just fucking died. So we're like, we well, just gotta eat something, man. We don't fucking... Like on New Year's Eve when we played King's Cup? No, when I happened once, but like... It might have been that night. It might have been that night. On New Year's Eve, I did pretty good on Peking's Cup. I was only a month out from a concussion. A major concussion. I think y'all are in trouble the next time we play. Oh, dear. Bring it on, bald man! We gotta do, like, shots with our... Pick up buffalo shot, like... Do what? Never mind. Better yet, buffalo. I was, I was normally talking to you. Buffalo I mean, like, sauce you know, like you, shots. You know, like you know like how you take a blowjob shot, you do it, but you just do it. You, buzz, you, know. you want to take a shot with your butt? Well, not, not with everybody. I mean, like you, like you take a say, you know, the blowjob shots. You know, you can take it. You know, you know what I'm saying? You can do it with your butt. Hand me the shot glass, <laughs> and I'll demonstrate how to do one. No. Wait, no. wait, wait, whoa, whoa! No, no. <laughs> this is YouTube. YouTube's not ready for that. Yeah, no. I don't give a fuck, Susan, Susan Wojcinski, whatever the fuck her name is, can eat my nuts. Who the fuck is Susan Wojcinski? Yeah. The bitch who owns YouTube. Oh. There's a bitch who owns YouTube? Yes. What the fuck are we doing here? Hey, Susan. <coughs> Tits or get the fuck out. Is in the rocky waters, hide away your 